Hi everyone, my name is Sweeney Mae from All Abroad Podcast and today for our food trip and episode with Adobers.net, we are going to meet the ladies of the Embotido, California. The embutidos is it's a party food, right? So it's a happy food. Okay. This was conceptualized way before, and then we we put focus on it during the pandemic, mm -hmm. when everyone was really affected, feeling sad, feeling lost. Mm -hmm. It's Got a it. happy food, right? Yes. It's yes. a handa and food. Yes. So. During the pandemic, when we gave it also to relatives and friends, since all the restaurants were closed, right? Yeah. So, nakaka-happy. Parang sila, oh, alright. Like, wow. Embutido. It reminded them of the fiestas, of the birthday parties, of any, any happy celebrations. So, right now, we have nine flavors. So, it's not just the classic, but we have the four cheese. The spicy nori, which is a, we gave a twist to the regular embotido, mm -hmm. we wrapped it in seaweed, and then we have the salted egg, which is my favorite. Then we have the crimp nori, it's a seafood embotido, mm -hmm. white crimp because it's a combination of crab and shrimp. It comes in either pork or chicken. Oh, okay. So if I say I want four cheese and I want to order it in chicken. Yes. Oh, there's a chicken picture right yes. there. Wow. There's a little piggy picture. <laughs> this is a beautiful box. How, how, when they order, do they get this box? Or when depends? They, um, when they ask for it. Because um, this was used for, we started with the box when some corporations ordered it for Christmas mm. giveaways and like, like a you know a dentist gave it away also yeah. to her clients yeah this so, is yeah. cool like if you guys so if you guys are looking for holiday gifts this is great so how like how many do you have to order to get this box um the box can contain a dozen to 15 mm, okay and then we have a bigger box that can contain 20 20 rolls or more wow. yes if it's gold it's chicken oh, okay. if it's silver it's pork. Huh. It's pork. Got it. Wow. So Sweeney May, so this one is already cooked. Uh -huh. So all they have to do is just reheat it. So it's so easy. If they don't have time, you know how it is here in America. Everyone mm -hmm. is so busy with work. So from the freezer, straight from the freezer, they can just put it in a microwave or put pan it in the fry. pan fry. Quick frying. Yeah, or put it in a toaster. Oven? Toaster? Yes, yes. toaster okay. oven and then that's it. Air fryer. Air fryer. Yeah. So for all of you guys air that went fryer. and got your air fryers, you can air fry this too. Okay. For busy moms, this is very ideal. Yeah. Because you know the kids, I mean, just wait for like 10 minutes or less and they have a quick meal. And right. at the same time, you know, there's vegetables in there. So yeah. <laughs> there is. Those, I, thought yes. I, saw, I thought it was packed. Oh, I see. It's packed okay. with meat, but also it has vegetables. So for those kids that doesn't eat vegetables, so... They don't know that there's some wow. carrots over pwede, there. Pwede maitago wow. <laughs> sa mga bata. How much time do you spend, like, making embutidos? So, um, let's say in a day, the work week. would be like three days in a week because uh -huh. we work 12 hours. Yeah. So the rest of the day, the rest of the days of the week, we're in the kitchen yeah. or we're out do, doing our chunk to chunk or pop ups. Yeah. I mean, you, you know, you can't tell me Filipinos are lazy because we're always <laughs> into multiple things. Not just the main job, we have the side hustle, and sometimes the side hustle has a side hustle. For that's trained, yes. right. These are you know the Imbotito ladies, but this is not their full time job. But look at this. This is beautiful. You but that's I think that we party as well. I, and and the other side hustle that's is partying. <laughs> that's the most important thing. We balance. Yeah. We balance. Embotidos. Okay, who wants to go first? 
I'm gonna go for the classic, I think. So here. It's yummy. Ooh. I'm gonna slice. Oh my gosh, look at that. I saw already the. Oh, look at that. Yeah, the flavor. Yes. Yeah. Mmm, <laughs> it's good. Very flavorful. Let me taste it. Thank you. Yeah, please. Mm. All right. I'm going for the spice. Is the sauce on top? Oh my god, it's so good. Oh, yeah. cutie? Yep. Cutie. It's, so, it's yep. so good. I want to try salted egg because you said that was a good one. Oh. It's one of our best sellers of salt today. Oh, it's the best seller? Yes. And spicy. my personal favorite. Mm. Not too spicy. Mm. <laughs> I could really taste the salted egg. Yeah. It's really thank you. good. Thank you. And it blends with the uh, meat, with the carrots, with, the with everything. Yeah. Mm. Because yeah. of the raisins mm -hmm. and the... So it's Perfect. Try the four cheese. It's more spicy noodles. So right now you have six flavors. Do you plan on adding any more flavors soon? Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. What's, the, what's the next one? To call sneak peek! Sneak peek! Yeah. <laughs> That's for the lab. Fun. It's for you guys to find out we're adding two more flavors. The first to be out would be something meatless. <laughs> oh, I would love that vegan, vegan. Yes, yeah, that's more. Oh, and then the yeah. second one would be more pork lovers. <laughs> it's more for the pork lovers. It's yeah. the ultimate pork lovers uh, and both vegan. You get a lot of non-Filipinos also who buy the embotito serene. So it started with like um, husband of a Filipina oh, or wife okay. of a Filipino yeah. and then they spread it to their friends and families as well and to their family. I can tell like kids would love this too. I was wondering if you could do seasick uh, and botido. Or was it? Oh, oh, oh there's something. Let's see, let's see. Yeah. Seasick and yeah. botido, that would be that's good. Interesting. Yeah. That's interesting. Seasitido. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Yang. Hi, I'm Avon. And we are the Embotitos. And you can find the Embotitos in adobers.net. <laughs>